Color Punch, it's been a big year for Al Gore. Uh, the fictitious movie he put out, An Inconvenient Truth, was skewered, uh, with uh, riddled with uh, inaccuracies, but nonetheless received an Oscar nomination. Last week he got to be, be a Grammy presenter at the largest uh, music awards in our nation. And coming up this summer, he's going to be the largest concert host ever. Well, he won't be the largest host. He'll be the largest concert, and he hopes to host it. It's going to be the global warming equivalent of Live Aid. How would that be pronounced? Glob Warm Aid? Uh, whatever the case may be, he's invited bon, John Bon Jovi, Sting, and Pharrell Williams, the rapper, to come and tout the values of global climate change. Speaking of Pharrell Williams and speaking of Al Gore, wasn't it Tipper Gore, his wife, that led the, the crusade against explicit lyrics in our music industry today? Uh, lyrics like from the Pharrell Williams song, oh, I can't say those words. Uh, maybe uh, uh, lyrics from the Pharrell Williams song, I can't say those words either. I, in fact, I can't even tell you the titles of these songs because they're so explicit. The truth is, uh, the Gores are an enigma wrapped in a paradox, wrapped in mystery, and I don't know much about who they are. I just know that I don't trust his view on global climate change and her view on what makes explicit lyrics. As Christians, we need to think biblically, clearly, articulately, and that's what we hope to do every weekday on the Musclehead Revolution. Join us next time.